Shocking news in Victorville where a stray dog suddenly attacks a little girl while she was walking to school with her siblings. A woman who lives nearby stepped in to help. KTLA's Inland Empire reporter Shelby Nelson talked with the Good Samaritan. Just thinking about it, it's it's still unreal to me. An unreal experience that Victorville resident Maria Hernandez is still shaken from and partly because of what you see right here. A dog jumping onto a little girl just outside her house. It was like any other morning. Kids were outside walking to school along Mesa Linda Avenue. At around 7 a.m. Maria's daughter came to her telling her what she saw outside of the window. Mom, the dog is dragging the little girl from the head and I got up and just ran down and first thing I grabbed was my broom. Maria's mom instincts kicking in. She tells her kids to stay inside the house. Surveillance video shows her running in the direction of the seven year old girl who she says had been walking with her siblings. By the time I got out, the dog had the little girl on the other side of the of the house already by the leg. He had ripped off all her clothes. She says she put the broom in front of the dog, creating a barrier. She pulled the little girl who was bleeding from her head behind her. He followed us to my door and I just had the broom. When we got to the door, we couldn't open the door. So he tried. That's when he got a little bit more aggressive. He tried like, jumping towards her. Somehow they managed to get inside her house safely. Maria tried wrangling the little girl's siblings, but they ran off. The girl was later hospitalized. Deputies did get a call. They responded along with our city animal control. Neighbors had seen the dog the night before. Officials with the city of Victorville say it was a stray Belgian Melanois mix that was not microchipped. The dog is now in quarantine with Victorville Animal Control. As for Maria, she knows it could have ended a lot worse had she not come out to rescue the girl. He wouldn't have let go. He was after her. I could only imagine what she's going through. And Maria says the reason she is speaking out is so that parents are aware. In the meantime, that little girl luckily is going to be okay. Reporting live in Victorville, I'm Shelby Nelson, KTLA 5 News.